Hi guys, Nisi Love Harmon here of What She Creating Enterprises, and today I will be showing you how to oil the Brother XL5340 sewing machine. So let's get started. First thing you need is a small screwdriver, as such, your sewing machine, and sewing oil. I am using a Liberty 100% synthetic lubricant oil that I found on um, an online site. So you can check out the description and I can give you a link to this type of oil. So I'll be using this to oil today. Now in the instructions, it states that this machine should be oiled every week, which is kind of crazy, but that's what the Brother brand states. So let's show you how to do that. First thing, we're going to oil the bottom and then we will oil the top. So first thing you need to do is take the sewing extension box off if you already have it off. And then we're going to unscrew these two. Let's put these screws to the side. Let's take the presser foot off. There's a little latch in the back. So I'm going to push it and take the presser foot off. I'm going to take off the needle plate here and pull the, um, the bobbin case holder down. So let's take the top off of our oil and we're going to put a drop in two spots. We're going to put a drop back here as well as in there. So one drop here and one drop in here. Okay, and that is how you oil the bottom. There is a screw here. We are going to unscrew. Okay, so we're gonna take this um, light, I guess this box that holds the light, we're gonna take that off. And then we're going to take our oil and we're going to oil in five different spots. All right, everyone, so let's oil the top. I have my trusty oil here with the long spigot and we're going to oil in five places. We will oil here, 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 there, and here. So let's do it. <laughs> That's a lot of places to oil. I'm gonna use my left hand. We're gonna put a drop here, a drop here, a drop here, a drop here, and a drop a drop here okay so you may need to have a paper towel if there's any drainage or to, uh, excess oil but other than that we have oiled our machine which it doesn't seem so complicated but you just have to hit those spots so we're going to put our enclosure back on We've done that. Let's put is put the needle plate back on and screw the screws back in. Okay, be careful of the needle. While you do all this, you don't want to stick your finger. I'm going to put the presser foot back on. Okay, close it back up. Put the extension box back on it. And now you have a fully oiled, fully like new 
brother xl5340 sewing machine so thank you for viewing our video follow us on instagram and facebook leave us a comment or or give us video ideas so thank you for watching and happy sewing